Good morning and welcome to In Light Connections. Uh, you have here Marilyn Gary and uh, Ernie Dorsey and I am Loretha Mayberry. And uh, we, the first session we did was on uh, Can an Old Man Be Born Again? And this, this part, I hope that you caught the first session, but this part is transformation. Uh, stop the butts ifs. <laughs> now, what I, want, I meant to ask one of you guys to, to honor Joanne and oh, kind of yes. elaborate on mm -hmm. some of that before we <laughs> get into this, and, and I didn't think to. You think you can, one of you, or either right. both. Well, okay. our sister Joanne, she was a member of Agape Worship Center International, and um, she, she left uh, for personal reasons. Uh, nothing personal, but uh, her her family her family was started taking her to another church. Anyway, we decided to spring a visit on her, and um, it was like old times. She uh, she is always in a teaching mode, and she was a teacher, uh, and so um, somewhere in there she was teaching us and it was like old times and then all of a sudden she says we got to stop the but ifs mm -hmm. but if but if the you know excuses, in other yeah words. making excuses <laughs> yes for not doing what God tells us to do Amen. and so that's where we're at that's that's the topic for today so and uh, to kind of just uh, paraphrase <clears throat> the first session we talked about being born again and how you get born again, and um, basically um, how to do to stay born again. And then it's filling over to this session where we're going to talk about um, how God dwells on the inside of you. Could I say something about the born again experience? Yes, please. And I don't think we got across in the last session, but just to kind of summarize it again, when you're born again, you should have some change occur Absolutely. Mm -hmm. in how you think, how mm -hmm. you act, how you walk, mm -hmm. what you believe in, mm -hmm. how you talk. Yes. Right. You know, if you had a bad mouth at one time, you know, sometimes people <laughs> curse every mm -hmm. two or three words. Sure, you better quit stand <laughs> on my feet. All of, <laughs> all of those things change mm -hmm. when you really are right. truly born again. Mm -hmm. But my pastor, and I tend to, Really, I've seen this now because it, it caught, it was a red flag to me when he has said it more than once, that many of you here in the congregation are not really truly born again. <laughs> uh -huh. Have you really had a born again experience? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Sometimes we get saved mm -hmm. and we go to the altar and we give our life to Christ, but we're not born again. We accept Jesus in our heart, but we're not born again. We're not truly changed mm -hmm. by the Spirit of mm -hmm. God, allowing Him to change us right. so that we see change in, in us, mm -hmm. that He begins to, like this uh, session today is going to talk about, see transformation yes. in our yes. lives. Because being transformed, mm -hmm. it's not really a change. Mm -hmm. It's being created into something brand new that Absolutely. wasn't there before. Renewal Absolutely. of your brand Re new. Right. We're mm -hmm. brand new. Absolutely. In Jesus' name. And then you think about, um, what's that? What, what's the butterfly born out of? Uh, caterpillar? Yes. Mm -hmm. That, that cal caterpillar turns into a, a, just a gorgeous mm -hmm. butterfly. Mm -hmm. And so that's a, that's a type of transformation. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. so that's the way we ought to be mm -hmm. when we truly give our lives to Christ. Mm -hmm. We yeah. ought to become, and this what the scripture is going to tell us, that we become new creatures. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We, we no longer do the things that we used to do. Matter of fact, you don't even want to. That's it. You, that's don't, it. you don't want to, and then you lose a whole bunch of friends. So mm -hmm. I mean, And that's all right, because God mm -hmm. will give you uh, brothers and sisters through the blood of Jesus mm -hmm. that uh, is walking the same journey that you're walking. Amen. And so uh, I'm going to read 1 Corinthians 5, 17. Second. Uh, I'm sorry. Second. Second Absolutely But you know right. that being born again, though, I hate to keep going, talking about this again, but what I'm just oh, no, no, feeling to. is that if you don't get saved, 
You're gonna. If you're not gonna go to heaven, you're going to hell. Mm-hmm. Where is your spirit? Where, down to where are you gonna live it. eternally? Bring it, bring it down. <laughs> where are you gonna have eternal life? Yeah, yeah. Where's yeah. your? Where are you gonna spend eternity? Mm-hmm. Come on. Where are spirit on. beings? <laughs> right. We live forever somewhere. Mm-hmm. And when Adam so grew up, <laughs> and then Jesus came and made another way come with on, a brand new on. covenant. He mm-hmm. said, this is a new covenant in my blood. Yes, yes. He covered us with the blood of Jesus. Mm-hmm. Then now we have a rightful entry into the kingdom of God to live forever. Yes. So that our, we live forever. Our spirits will live forever in him, mm-hmm. in heaven, mm-hmm. heavenly places. We live there now in heavenly places. Right. So you want to continue to run, let the devil run you to the ground, run you around, <laughs> take all your money, beat you up, <laughs> cause all these issues, send you to the hospital, get, make you sick. Preach that's, prophet. That's all from the devil. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, but it's coming preach, out. It's preach the name prophet. Of Jesus. Right, right. Hallelujah. We got to get saved. Yes, amen. Really, amen. not just not just saved, but born again. Yes, get changed. yes, yes. So you know where you're going to live eternity at. Right, Woo. exactly. Jesus. Man, you know, I'm laughing because man. I've been man. tipping around, mm-hmm. tipping around. Woo. But you brought it out. <laughs> yeah, there, there, there is mean, a fervency it, about it, yeah. you know, because yeah. there's yeah. no... There's, Ooh. we don't have a lot of time. Huh, we think right. we do, but we don't have a lot of time because, now. you know, the kingdom of God is, is upon us, yes. you know, and he's given us years and yeah. years and years of warning. Yes. You know, he's yes. told us, it says in the word short. that w- what we're supposed to do, that's <laughs> yes. the cookbook yes. right there. But yes. if we don't follow the ingredients, mm-hmm. Time We're baking the wrong thing. Yeah. <laughs> time yeah. is short. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Time to quit playing Hallelujah. games. Hallelujah. Time to Hallelujah. quit playing games with the Lord. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory <laughs> to God. Hallelujah. Ah. So, oh, shit. They both shut up. The Holy Ghost has, nah. has not left the building. Hallelujah. The Holy Ghost has Hallelujah. enveloped us. <laughs> yes. Oh, oh my God. God. I thank you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God, I thank you. Mm. Hallelujah. Yeah, I, was, I was tipping around there. Ooh. in the <laughs> Glory. That's why Jesus. I'm laughing because Glory God is Jesus. so awesome. Yes, he, yes. He, he, he just he just overshadowed her and, mm-hmm. and caused her to just start just bubbling up, and it spitting, out. Yep. spitting yep. it out. Yeah, exactly yep. like it is. Mm-hmm. And so I thank God for that. Thank you, Lord. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. Now I'm gonna read. I think I am. I just have Uh-oh. one more interruption. You remember? You remember a time there was a commercial that said, "Do you know where your kids are tonight?" Mm-hmm. Well, this this just went through my head. Do you know where you're going when you leave this earth? Wow. <laughs> Do you know? Exactly. Wow. Right. That's, a good That's a wow. question we need to ask ourselves question. every day. Wow. Every day. Wow. Oh God, have mercy wow. on our souls. Hallelujah. My Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My goodness. Hallelujah. My goodness. Hallelujah. You know, um, there, there's, there's so many uh, people mm-hmm. who um, say, and maybe they have given their lives to Christ, but mm-hmm. they don't even realize that God dwells on the inside. Right. Mm-hmm. I, I have uh, I've been ministering and talk about how you made up of three parts and that God mm-hmm. dwells on the inside and people be looking at me like mm-hmm. I'm speaking another language. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And so I know that this, this uh, topic, mm-hmm. everything that we're bringing here this mm-hmm. evening, mm-hmm. well, mm-hmm. to you this morning, mm-hmm. uh, is from God. Mm-hmm. And, he, and he wants, he, and whoever ears is dropping on, mm-hmm. you are com- becoming mm-hmm. responsible mm-hmm. For, for hearing what you're hearing. Mm-hmm. Amen. Responsible for making change if you need to make change. Amen. Uh, now, I think again, I'm gonna read this uh, scripture here. Uh, second Chronicle, uh, excuse me, Second Corinthians, the fifth mm-hmm. chapter, the 17th verse. Therefore, if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. Just what we have been sharing with you, that mm-hmm. you become new. You, 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 you be looking the same, actually you change from the outside mm-hmm. because it come from the inside out. Mm-hmm. Uh, but actually the big change takes, takes on the inside. The old things are passed away. Mm-hmm. So where you used to go on a go and party, um, fornicate, adulterize, or whatever, mm-hmm. you, don't, you don't want to do those things That's anymore. Right. And it, it might not be that you, maybe you was a pathological liar, mm-hmm. or uh, you know things that we see that's not 
we think they're not that bad, you mm -hmm. know. But sin is sin. Yeah. Behold, all things are become new. And the 18th verse says, and all things are of God who had reconciled us to himself by Jesus Christ. And that's by him going to the cross mm -hmm. and dying for us. Mm -hmm. and, and it continues to say, and hath given to us the ministry of reconciliation. Amen. Wow. Mm -hmm. What is reconciliation? It's not bringing things back to the original back in right form. standing with right. God. Yes. Right position. Right, right position with mm -hmm. God. Mm -hmm. Amen. Where Adam and Eve messed up things mm -hmm. through Jesus Christ, the second Adam, mm -hmm. uh, we are reconciled mm -hmm. back to mm -hmm. God. He, he, he's the bridge back to God. Mm -hmm. that's, that's awesome. Amen. And it, this is where ahead. the but ifs come in mm -hmm. because we we have a tendency to say, but, but if uh, Eve hadn't eaten that apple, yeah. mm -hmm. but if this hadn't happened, mm -hmm. but if I didn't grow up in a bad neighborhood, mm -hmm. but if my parents were married, mm -hmm. I would be different. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's like time to stop it exactly. and face reality mm -hmm. and take responsibility. That's good. Exactly. Mm -hmm. yep. Amen. That's good. That's good. Time to grow up. That's Lord right. Jesus. And I said a little earlier how um, a lot of people don't realize that their body is the temple of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And when I just said that, it was like I saw the veil split from the top mm -hmm. to the bottom, mm -hmm. where um, it's symbolic that we don't have to go to man you know, uh, and repent mm -hmm. and all that. We can go straight to the throne mm -hmm. of God. Mm -hmm. And he said, he tells us, he said, we can come boldly, boldly. Mm -hmm. to, to, his, to his throne of grace mm -hmm. and, and, and pray and seek him. Yes. Mm -hmm. And um, so, but our body is God's mm -hmm. temple. Mm -hmm. he, he, he's, he's right here. You know, sometimes we think God is way up there and, uh, we got to call him into the service and mm -hmm. just all kinds of things that we, we, we get into our mindsets mm -hmm. that's not true. Mm -hmm. okay. And, and what's, so, what's so amazing about it is um, if, you, if you're lying or, or if you're fornicating and, and you've given your life to Christ mm -hmm. and he's dwelling in there, uh, mm -hmm. uh, he's, he's right there because he's on the inside of you. Right. I mean, isn't that right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. And so, right. you know, I think that that I'll would help you. us to, to, mm -hmm. to um, live a little bit better lives if we realize mm -hmm. that God is omnipresent. He's, he's everywhere at one time. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, he's on the inside of you if you're mm -hmm. really truly born again. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yeah. Thanks for making that clear. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because when we say that we are born again and, we, and we, there's no fruit and we are not, mm -hmm. then he's not dwelling in, on the inside of us. He says, be ye holy because I am holy. That's right. And that means be consecrated, be set apart. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. From the rest of the world. That's right. Amen. That's right. And we're going to kind of get into that a little bit when we, let me see here. Uh, uh, 1 Corinthians, the 6th chapter, starting at the 19th verse. Mm -hmm. And uh, it starts, Paul starts with a question. What? Mm -hmm. Know ye not that mm -hmm. your body is the temple of the Holy Ghost, which mm -hmm. is in you, which ye have of God, mm -hmm. and ye are not your own? Mm -hmm. Wow. Do you, do you hear that? You're not mm -hmm. your own. We, no. Mm -hmm. So, you know, where people think that they can do whatever, it's yeah, their body. They can, you can go mm -hmm. and abort babies if you want to. Mm -hmm. uh, you can go and you can uh, have same-sex marriage if you want to. Mm -hmm. uh, it, it's your body. Mm -hmm. You do what you want to do with it. Well, I tell you what, God will turn, turn us over to a reprobate mind. I don't think that was just for... Uh, the homosexuals and the lesbians. Mm -hmm. I think that's in, anybody that wants to deny his word yeah. right. and, and, and live outside of his principles. Mm -hmm. 
uh, did I read all of that? No, you didn't read verse 20. 20. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. For ye are brought, oh yes. That's the most important For ye part. are bought with the price. Amen. What is the price? Jesus Christ is saved. He died mm -hmm. yes. for our sins. Mm -hmm. Yes. 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 I hope you heard that. Jesus mm. Christ. That's the price. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. The price was paid. That was paid. Mm -hmm. He didn't have to stay on the cross. Come on. Come on. Mm -hmm. He could have gotten off mm -hmm. anytime he wanted mm -hmm. to, but he love to kept him there. Ha, mm -hmm. glory. Mm. Mm -hmm. For ye are bought with a price. Therefore, glorify God in your body. Mm -hmm. Glorify God in your body and in your spirit which are God's. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Everything we have belong to God. Amen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, it's, it's just awesome. Mm -hmm. It's just awesome. Do you have anything to say about any of that? I just think that it, when you say that, the, the main thing I think about is just knowing that uh, I don't have to worry about anything. Right. I have that comfort, you know, and that peace mm -hmm. of knowing and being satisfied, knowing that I belong to Jesus, mm -hmm. to God, and, and I don't have to worry about anything. I don't have to fear anything. He takes care of everything. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Right. Glory. Mm -hmm. And you know, that is so true. But sometimes, because don't forget mm -hmm. that just like there's God, there is an enemy, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the devil. Yes. Mm -hmm. And sometimes he may come and... Um, punch you and knock you to the floor. Mm -hmm. But once you remember whose child you mm -hmm. are mm -hmm. and began to use some of the scriptures, some of the words that, that, that he has helped you to get on the inside of you through by reading and studying the word, mm -hmm. uh, I've known times that, I, that I, I come back, I'm like a bull in a china ca mm -hmm. closet. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I'm saying that, that at that time, mm -hmm. I was like, wow, I, I remember telling my son, he was still at home, uh, to go to church and tell this certain woman to, to pray for me. And I stayed home and prayed, continued to pray for myself. Mm -hmm. And when I, when I gained my strength, uh, he was sorry that he had messed with me. Mm. Mm -hmm. And I said that because the devil don't like for you, you don't like what we're doing right, right now. Right. Because this is helping someone to get free. Mm -hmm. And um, mm -hmm. my doing ministry and, and, and going into different places and ministering mm -hmm. and stuff, mm -hmm. I knew I was giving him a black eye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. I like yeah. to say that his, his middle name is conviction. And he wants to convict us into thinking that it don't take all that. You mean condemn us? Convict us oh. to make us feel first, and oh. then because it the don't have to be to true. Huh? The devil wants to convict you. He wants to convict us to oh. make us feel like what we're doing. It don't take all of that. Mm. You know, he doesn't want us praying. He doesn't want us. Uh, Spreading wants, the so word. Convicting you mean feel guilty. Right. Yeah. About it. Okay. But I hear what you're saying. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah, I'm thinking condemnation. Condi right. right. Well, both of them. Wrong. The Holy, both the, of them. The Holy Spirit's one yeah. that comes convicts. And convicts. Yeah. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I, I hear you. Mm -hmm. Okay. I but I understand what you're saying. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. he starts it. So, <laughs> you know, but it's, it's like mm -hmm. I know what God said. Mm -hmm. And I know that I am a child of God. And I know that God is in me. And so, you know, I go from there, you know, and it's like, yeah. you know, the heck with the devil mm -hmm. because he is a defeated foe. Yes. And he is, he doesn't have any right to be in my face at all. Not at all. So. Not at all. Not at all. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. I was going to add just, you know, when you go through this transformation, after a point, you get to a point in God and having such a relationship with him. And this is what we mean by, and what the Lord has been saying about, get ready, get ready, get ready. Mm -hmm. You know, he's at the door. Mm -hmm. He's drawing so nigh to us. Mm -hmm. Is that you have to have a relationship with him. You Come really on, have to right. know him. That's right. You can't that's watch good. and pray mm -hmm. and see his appearing with a twinkling of an eye, which is 
and probably as far as time is concerned, mm -hmm. it's a shorter dog. time than blinking your eye, mm -hmm. <laughs> twinkling. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Bye bye. You you can't you can't be ready if you're not in relationship with him. Right. And you can't be in relation with That's him right. unless you're born, truly born again. That's right. And I think once you get under the shadow of his wings, mm -hmm. and you know how Psalm 91 says that he's mm -hmm. there to protect us mm -hmm. and prevent us from falling. Once you get it, I think once you get in a certain place in God, the enemy can't do nothing to you, mm -hmm. no matter how he tries. Mm -hmm. It's just that he cannot get nothing past you. Mm -hmm. He's like, I can't touch that one. Yeah. I just can't, I can't get but in I'm there. But I'm gonna tell you something, he's gonna come. <laughs> Oh yeah, right. Your Don't challenges right. will be there, and, and if you have that relationship, mm -hmm. um, and, and and the way you're going to have the relationship is through by the word of God and mm -hmm. praying and mm -hmm. worshiping Him, and mm -hmm. building That's that right. relationship mm -hmm. yes. to where That's you, good. like Amen. Jesus said, His sheep know His Amen. voice. Right, there you'll you know right. when He comes, right. when He's telling you different mm -hmm. stuff. Mm -hmm. yes. you can tell Him to. to get lost yes. Uh, yes. when he's trying to uh, say the bank give you too much money and, mm -hmm. and uh, you'll know to return Go it back, back mm -hmm. and say, you, know, you gave me too much money. Mm -hmm. Amen. Instead of talking about God just bless me. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but he will put money in your bank account. This right, time. right. <laughs> well, so and, and, know the difference between the two. <laughs> yeah, yeah, know the difference between the two. Yeah, and, and, and because you don't, you don't know where it came from, so right. what can you do? God yeah, fixed especially it. if the banker say, hey, mm -hmm. I don't know, it's yours. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's in your account. Right. God, God fix it Amen. like that. Right. But you if know. you're on the right side of, of Christ mm -hmm. and you go, like if you go to the bank, if you <laughs> yeah. were to just keep quiet, don't yeah. say it, nothing, and yeah. then can't, uh, can't rest because yeah. every time the door, somebody's at the door, you think they're coming to get you. <laughs> yeah. But if you just relax, God, mm -hmm. God will just make you have peace. When you have that relationship with him or you love him, love him, mm -hmm. love him that much, you'll do nothing to just That's right. Him. That's All you right. want to do right. is please him. Mm -hmm. Right. And, but mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you something. <laughs> Those of you out there, God will test you. Yeah, that's what I was getting I, ready to say. I was <laughs> tested. Out of my mouth. I was tested mm -hmm. right there on Radio that's how Highway you get promoted. at the bank. That's how you get that's promoted. Right. Mm -hmm. That's right. You pass mm -hmm. those tests. That's right. That Amen. woman that gave me 200 and some dollars, mm -hmm. I don't forget how it all was supposed to go, but I, I remember that she had mm -hmm. given me too much money. Mm -hmm. And the thought came, and that was not my thought, the thought mm -hmm. came, you need to leave now. Mm -hmm. But then... <laughs> <laughs> but then the next the thought bank. came to tell her, <laughs> mm -hmm. and when I went to tell her, mm -hmm. she recognized the same time. Mm -hmm. So I know that it was God right, testing right, me, right. but I passed the test. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. I passed now the that's test. That's it. It's a good yes. feeling, huh? Yes, it oh, felt yeah. good. I had passed that test. Mm -hmm. Then he could trust you. Yeah, he could trust you with more. Oh, yes. girl, you're about to yes. make run yes. right now. Yes, man. Yes. Oh, man, thank you, God. Yes. Oh. <laughs> okay, we have one, one last scripture that's really powerful, but I wanted you to do that prophetic word, uh, Romans 12, 1 through 3. And what it talks about is not being uh, conformed to the world. Mm -hmm. There you um, go. Amen. You know, and I'm, I, mm -hmm. I think I'll just try to paraphrase it a little bit and, mm -hmm. so you can get to that prophetic word. But uh, to, conform, to conform to the world is that you're doing everything that the world is doing mm -hmm. and professing to be a safe mm -hmm. person. Mm -hmm. And uh, he said, to the, the Bible tells us here to not be conformed mm -hmm. to the world, to the world. Mm -hmm. uh, be in, in the second verse, be not conformed to this world, but That's be right. transformed. transformed. And so, uh, could you hear that, that transform you talked about? Transformation, it, being uh -huh. renewed by yeah. your in your mind, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. transformed by the renewal of your mind. Your mm -hmm. mind completely mm -hmm. has to be renewed, right. how mm -hmm. you think, how you act, right, how you right, talk. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, we are really little Christ. Mm -hmm. We begin to walk in mm -hmm. that authority that we have. Mm -hmm. And that's how we are able to be successful Christians. Mm -hmm. I think here it says also that by testing, you may discern what is the will of God? What is yes. good and acceptable and perfect? Mm -hmm. So will you test, God. yes, you're testing mm -hmm. what, you know, what your the experiences that you're in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. We don't think like the world anymore. That's right. That's it. You That's can't. Right. Mm -hmm. You can't. Mm -hmm. Right. You don't, you don't even want to. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then you don't, you don't, uh, uh, the friends of, 
kick you to the side, but it's okay because you don't mm -hmm. really want to be around you know, them anymore. You'll send you some new friends. Well, yeah. and you don't fit anymore. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> right. They can't control you yeah, anymore. Right. <laughs> they get right. tired of you talking about God. They, <laughs> yeah, I don't want to hear, hear all of that. Yeah. You better get to that word, folks. That, our time is running out. You know, yeah, in but, the last session, we, we shared a word about... Um, what was it? You're an original. Mm -hmm. And the Lord had put on my heart, um, Don, Don McGarry, you're my daughter. Mm -hmm. I have a word of the Lord from mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. He's, I'm, for, from me, I'm saying thank you for your love and support. Amen. You are my inspiration. You inspire me. You keep me going, knowing that we can do all things through Christ, Christ who strengthens Jesus. us. Come on. You are my example. God told me to tell you one step at a time, yes. one step at a time. Yes. And that's what that uh, prophetic word about being original is mm -hmm. about. Mm -hmm. You must mm -hmm. pull yourself mm -hmm. away and go unto him as he continues mm -hmm. to work and do a work in you. He is transforming you from the inside out mm -hmm. in Jesus name. And then the last thing mm -hmm. I did want to say is, um, Margaret Shine. Mm. Hi, how are Hi, you? I, I told Apostle to tell you hello for me. I'm telling you on mm -hmm. TV. Good. Hi, Margaret. And then my dad, who supports our program and mm -hmm. watches us every mm -hmm. time we go on. He's just grinning from ear to ear. And he says he knows Apostle Larita. Mm -hmm. Hi, Daddy. Hi, Mr. And my ex-husband, who is always on. Amen. Uh, hey, Jean. Hey, Jean. <laughs> Amen. Amen. I just wanted to, to, to tag on to uh, the word that you have for, for Don. For Don. Uh, because what I saw was God said that he has pleased with you, Don, because you mm -hmm. have taken steps. Even though they were baby steps, God said that he... He uh, encouraged you. He stood on the sidelines and he cheered you on because you never stopped. You never gave up. Mm -hmm. You've gone through what you've gone through. Many of us could never do. Mm -hmm. We could never go through. But God, he knew he, wow. who he was picking. Oh, he God. chose you because he knew the manifestations that were going to happen. And he knew that you would pass. You would pass the test. Jesus. You have succeeded, uh -huh. says God. Hallelujah. Yeah. Praise yeah. God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Well, we Hallelujah. Hope you have enjoyed the session <laughs> uh, this morning, and uh, mm. we welcome you to come yes. and join us again. We love you. May God bless you and forever Hallelujah. watch over you. Amen. 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 See you next Bye. week. <laughs>